Okay, welcome. And in this video, we're going to talk about different parts of a circle and other geometric parts or definitions, uh, concepts that we want to know. Okay, so we're going to talk about arcs and angles, central angles. Okay, so an arc is just part of a circle. Okay, so in particular, if we take the circle O, well, any part of the circle would be an arc, okay? And we could talk about the measure of that arc. Uh, central angle. The central angle is formed by any two radii of, um, of the circle, okay? So, the central angle here would be formed by the radii AO and OB. So the angle here is called a central angle. Okay. Now the arc AB is the piece of the circle bounded by A and B, these line segments here. Okay. So this here is, is an arc. Now the thing about central angles and arcs is that the central angle and the arc that's bounded by the radii of the central angle have the same measure. So if this was 25 degrees, then the arc measure would also be 25 degrees. Okay. That's the relationship between central angles and the arc that is bounded by the central angle. Okay, or bounded by the radii of the central angle. Now, a sector is the region bounded by the central angle and its arc. So, for example, in this case here, the sector of this circle would be this. So, this would be a sector of the circle. That, would, that uh, region I shaded in was what we would call the sector of the circle. And the segment, a segment is the region of the circle that is bounded by a chord and its arc. So, for example, this would be chord AC, right? And so it has an arc AC. And so the segment of the circle is bounded by that shaded region. Okay. And that's it. See you next time.